Hi, this is Jill Dumas now discussing the distributive law. The distributive law states that multiplication distributes over addition. For example, 5 times the sum x plus 3 is 5 times x plus 5 times 3. Problems in which you distribute usually have instructions to simplify or expand the expression or simply to distribute. Examples are always helpful. 3 times x plus 4 is 3x plus 12. 5x squared times x plus 2 is 5x cubed plus 10x squared. The distributive law also generalizes to work with subtraction. Using the symmetry of equality that if a equals b then b equals a, we can write the distributive law backwards. By backwards we write a b plus a c equals a times b plus c. This form is also often used for factoring expressions. Factor is a verb that means to write as a product. Like writing 12 as 2 times 6 or as 3 times 4 or even writing 100 as 4 times 25. For example, 3x plus 6 can be written as 3 times x plus 2 or writing 3x plus 24 as 3 times the quantity x plus 8y. It's not always easy, however, to see what common factor needs to be factored out. Sometimes we want to explicitly factor each term before undistributing a common factor, as with this factor of 7. The distributive law is very powerful and is the way in which multiplication and addition interact. We will see more ways in which it's used in later videos.